Hi, my name's Neil from Nobody Special Financial Prepper Ninja Nation. Nah, not for many of those, but all three of those shows inspired me to put my face in the camera. I'm here to talk to you about why I feel CD CBDC will not succeed if it's even introduced. First off, uh, central banks only got re-interested -interest in pushing CDBCs because of the interest in cryptocurrencies. Interest in cryptocurrencies is waning right now, so I believe so would the uh, sediment for CDBCs that they perceive that is out there. Uh, second thing, the International Monetary Fund put out a statement from the Central Bank of England stating that they would not even be relatively close to ready to introducing a CDBC till 2025. That's like 805 days away, reason, or 880, what, yeah, 880 days, reason why that's important. The average recession only lasts 280 days, which I feel, you know, if we're going into a recession, that'd be a good time to uh, change currencies. Another point, uh, the fiat dollar was brought in 1971 and uh, speculated 2% inflation a year. 2%, 50 years, put it together. You know, we don't have till 2025, in my opinion, to change up currencies. Uh, let's see, what else would I like to say here? Oh, yeah. Uh, if they do try to go within the 280-day recession, average time period for recession, uh, for a, a Fed coin, uh, and England's not accepting it, how are you going to spend that Fed coin? How are you going to get into England or any other country that doesn't accept it? You'll... It, basically be imprisoning yourself to staying only in America until such time that other countries decide to accept that Fed coin. Uh, that would hurt their bottom line. So, you know, CDBCs has to be a worldwide accepted thing. And if you look around right now, the world is not really accepting of too many things. <laughs> too much war going on and people wanting to kill each other. So uh, CDBCs doesn't look like it's a positive thing. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, and I'm not too concerned though everyone else likes to waste time talking about it. And for my good friend Ivan at Wall Street Silver, a buddy of mine just came back from Canada and brought back some Canada gold. Thank you. Have a good evening.